put together a few words. So I'd love everybody here from Greg Brown on to silence for just a moment for everybody to understand how important Baba Thet has been to the culture, our community, and our children. One moment, please, for you, Jamie Harris. Over to you. Thank you, Merle. Thank, thank you for your attention for, for a few minutes. And the serious what Mo said, I mean, this, this is a really important thing for our community, and not only for Lafayette, but the whole musical community around the Bay Area and beyond, which I'll, I'll tell you a little bit about. I'd like to tell you about this man right here. This is Mr. Bob Athey. Those of you, most of you already know him, some of you might not. But I'm going to take a minute and talk about Bob. Bob is a teacher who exhibits the highest level of passion and commitment and responsibility, community building, and establishing a legacy for the future. Almost 32 years ago, my wife and I lived over the hill in Berkeley. We had three young children, and we were thinking about moving out here. And we came out to visit, and we ended up at Stanley Middle School. And after spending a little bit of time with the principal, who was gracious and took time to tell us about how wonderful the schools and the community here in Lafayette is, the first thing she did was walk us down to the old music room, Bob, behind the multi-purpose room before this beautiful music room that we have now at Stanley was built. And she introduced us to, oh, here's Mr. Hathade, our music teacher. Well, I have to tell you that, of course, we were much younger then. Here was a guy who had fire in his eyes and fire in his belly for what he was doing. It was just absolutely obvious from the moment that you met him. Standing among the students, the instruments, the music stands, everything in kind of cacophony. But here was a guy you knew instantly who was totally committed to what he was doing. And that has shown through all the time I've known Bob, my three kids going through Stanley Middle School, being, being friends with your children, Bob, making music together. Uh, and I have two, two sons. <laughs> Talk about establishing le legacy through passion and commitment and responsibility. My two sons are both professional musicians, and I blame it all on you, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> but they're, they're doing what they love. They're entertaining and performing, one of them internationally. And uh, it's, it's, it's because of the foundation they got from this teacher who taught them about responsibility, practice, discipline, and love of music, and love of giving music to other people. But there's more, and, and in my case, uh, I didn't start playing trombone until I was 50 years old. I saw my kids in the schools here, and I thought, that looks like fun. I'd like to learn to play a band instrument. Now, a lot of people would say, that's ridiculous, 50 years old. You're gonna... Who was encouraging? Who said, go for it? Who said, do it? Bob did, over and over. And now I get to have fun. But there's more to it than that. There's more to it than Bob's stellar teaching performance. And, and it, it's about building community. It's about this, this whole thing. The Rotary built it. But the reason that Rotary built it is because there was a, a, a music community here in Lafayette that was being built step by step, stakeholder by stakeholder, parent by parent, family by family for years. And there were others, of course. I don't want to take away from other people who participated in that. But Bob, we all know that you were the driving force. You, you were the fire in the belly that started all of that happening here in Lafayette. But there's more than that. It's not just Lafayette. You're going to see a combined band up here today of Stanley Middle School, our great school here in Lafayette, but also the Edna Brewer Middle School over in Oakland. Bob has reached out beyond the confines of our city and built, built bridges and built connections with a, a much larger music community and contributed and continues to contribute to other school districts and other music teachers and band programs around the area. And there's more than that. Because of what has happened here with Bob's leadership, taking responsibility to build a music culture and music community in this, in this town, Lafayette is on the map. You may know, not know that, but nationally, Lafayette is on the map as a music school, music education community. And every summer, through Generations in Jazz and Bob's direction of the music program, we run the Lafayette Summer Music Workshop, aka Jazz Camp, 
We have faculty, we have students who come from all over. They come from New York, they come from New Orleans, they come from Los Angeles, they come from all over the Bay Area. And again, they, they come here because Bob had the fire in the belly and the responsibility to build it. So I think we all owe Bob a Thade a huge thank you and gratitude. the show. Not quite yet. Bob, Bob, you can't go away. When uh, I was tutoring you, I taught you the three, um, three M's of business. You remember the three M's of business, mission, market, margin? You remember that? Yes, mission, mark. Well, today, Bob, I'm here to review the four M's of music with you, because you exemplify every single one of them, okay? First of all, Four M's of music are, you're a motivator, a huge motivator. There's the first M. You're a marvelous mass of energy, O-R-U-Ever. I'll make it quick, we'll make the three. And you're mighty damn good. So there's the three M's of music, we'll save the fourth one for later. I just want, on behalf of the community, on behalf of the Rossmore Band, on behalf of all the students that have grown beyond Lafayette, some professional musicians, some of them just have music in their heart, I am here to say thank you for everything that you were able to convey both by vibrating music and by discussing it, and by being there for students young and old now. Thank you, Bob. Would you please join me? Stand up, please, for Mr. Bob. Okay, this is a huge day to say thank you. To Bob is saying thank you. Thank you very much, Lafayette community and Oakland community. And uh, we're going to bring up, thank you so much, we're going to bring up the Stanley Chorus now. And uh, we'll be ready in just a moment. So Stanley Chorus, if you can come on up here, please. <laughs> 